Did you know that less than 10% of our viewers are subscribed to the channel? Subscribe now and don't miss any news from the Grand Theft Auto universe. Welcome back to GTA Insights. New ideas and discussions ahead. Stay tuned and take care. On Reddit user Alfie Brown posted a plot theory of the upcoming GTA game, here's what he had to say. I saw a comment about the two characters and how their actions could affect the story and I thought that since Red Dead Redemption 2 massively changed the storytelling in Rockstar's games and the honor system played a role in how some cutscenes and interactions played out I thought of a theory. You can switch between Jason and Lucia all through the game, however there's set missions that depending on which character you choose as that mission changes the story from then onwards, if you can understand what I'm saying. So. It could lead to the GTA 6 story having several different outcomes, each chapter ending differently depending on what you do as each character and having several different versions of the storyline that plays out. For example, in one mission you can have the choice to kill an important character or spare them, sparing them sets your players out with good honor. However, if you play as Jason and choose kill, Jason will evolve into a darker player over the game. Or the same with playing as Lucia and choosing kill. The story can change a lot throughout the game depending on the choices you make and which of the two characters you make those choices with. Stupid Reddit user Garbage talked about his idea of connecting Spotify or Apple Music account in the next GTA game, here's what he wrote. In the older versions you could put MP3S that would play as you played. But in today's world that can be easily replicated legally, probably, with this approach. We can already play Spotify on the PS5 by just signing into the app on the console. How cool would it be if you could drive around blasting your favorite tune in your headphones? It could also be a thing where shared play could be brought in where whoever owned the online session slash sets up the match can also share the playlist they have decided for that mission. Of course there will be some tights challenges but that can be managed by bundling a Spotify subscription to everyone who buys the game if they don't already have it, at a discount etc. User Stabs talked about the clothing textures for the upcoming GTA game, here's what he wrote. Lately I've been looking back at the leaked footage and saw something the devs were testing out which were the different types of textures that they're thinking about adding. Testing textures on cowboy hats it shows which is also seen in one clip in the leaks with a character wearing Arthur's hat where they were testing out different textures for cargo shorts. I also wonder if all the animals that will be added will have the same purpose of being used to wear on clothing like in RDR2. And will only be able to wear particular clothing items like bracelets, purses, shoes, ties, gloves, pants, shirts, and etc. if we collect and skin animals. What do you guys think? Leave your comment below and don't forget to subscribe for more GTA 6 news.